Okay, hi guys. Um, today we make a video on how to clean out your horse's hooves. And the reason we're giggling is because Veronica just started the camera on my phone with her nose. So because I got gloves on. So. <laughs> okay, so right now we're gonna pick out Chuck's hooves. Hey, show him the brush. Oh, this is like a pick. This is what you need to clean out your horse's hooves. You don't need the brushy thing. You don't need necessarily need the brush, which is like, oh, pff, I just flung it all into my eye. <laughs> It's just kind of like frozen almost. It's really stiff right now because it's cold. But we okay. use it just to brush off all the excess stuff. And I'll show you guys that. And it's also nice when you put Vaseline on the hooves. Uh-huh. And this, this will get all the junk out. Okay, so to pick up your horse's foot, let them know you're here. And then slide your hand down right here by the fetlock. And you sometimes you have to lean into them and squeeze right here and then pick up their foot. Some horses are really nice. He really it. needs a trim, like really bad. Ugh. He was. Chesney, can you grab my phone and say that? <laughs> okay, so I'll explain. This right here on the outside, here. That's all dead stuff. In it's the hoof wall. On the outside, this is the hoof wall. On this outside part, you can kind of see. You know how to work it? No. Take off your gloves. Right, this middle go. part right here is your sole. Right here are your bars. Right here, along the edges of the frog, okay, and then you have the frog. And so basically, you're gonna want to find your frog, and you're gonna go like this. Eh. Always be careful, though. Yeah, don't necessarily dig too deep. I go towards myself first, like this. And you, if there's a lot of stuff in there, you want to be kind of gentle until you figure out where it is, or you have to know your horse's hoof really well, which in Chuck's case I do. So I go towards myself. And then I go away. And he's, this is his frog. It's shedding. So I can go ahead and see. You can see this is all dead right here. So I'm going to rip that off. Oh. This is a piece of frog. If it's dead, it's okay. But yeah. you don't want to poke too hard because it'll hurt. But it's actually really durable. Like you can hit it with it and it won't yeah. hurt him. A lot of people are like, oh, you have to be very, some horses' feet are sensitive, but that's why some it's of really not that wear, bad. Um, horseshoes because it can. No. The, the well, reason you know I'm saying, though. The, that that's because of the owner's stupidity because their horse is getting proper nutrition to have good hoof health and there's crappy horrible breeding like in thoroughbreds. Oh, because they just breed the crap out of thoroughbreds. They don't breed for confirmation or anything else. They just breed for a horse. Yeah, pretty much. But then you can just brush everything out, which we don't really need to do in this case. It's been pretty dry here lately. But so, if it's muddy, you might want to. Back legs are a little different. And you gotta, I, I do what I call the farrier, which is basically how our farrier at least holds them. And you, it, I can do it. I'll just do it one-handed for show until after I get this hoof picked up. But same thing, let your horse know you're here. Slide down. Ask him to lift up. You basically pick it up the same, but you kind of have to pull back. And then I walk back. out. Here, so go scoot back a little bit. Okay. See? <laughs> I walk See? out. That way he's not having... That way he doesn't have his leg tucked up underneath him. It's and I use my whole leg. He, he can rest his whole leg on my thigh. And this is really good. Squats. Yeah. <laughs> Work out. So I'm, not, I'm just going to stick my hand in my pocket. But his this hoof is pretty clean. He's got mm -hmm. a little rock there in his sole. Get that out. So most of the time, you want to do this before and after before you ride. Before and after you ride. To make sure they don't have anything bad in their hoof. Because, um... One time, okay. Chuck got a nail, big, huge nail stuck in his frog, and he had to, if we hadn't have found him sooner, I mean, if we had, if we had have found him later, he w we would have had to euthanize him. Because it was just so bad. It was horrible. We had okay. to baby him for like six months, it was. And it was during the middle of winter, too. <laughs> it was horrible. It was horrid. We had like a little okay. red hoof thing. Well, same thing here. He's going to step over. I'm going to bring it out. Let him rest his leg on me. And See, you could do the front two first and then the back two, but we just do a huge circle I'm around the horse. Circle. And it helps if you do it the same way every time. Your horse will get into a routine. That yeah, then they he picks them up a lot easier than if you like do your front two first. He doesn't pick them up as good. And also, some horses' hooves, their frogs are kind of crooked. They'll like yeah. go like straight, and then they kind of like go one way. See, he didn't even really have to do anything for that one. This is his really good foot. He already knew it was coming, so he picked it up mighty fine. Okay, 
be, oh goodness, I just got some in my eye. Oh, listen, all this might smell really bad for the new people who do this. It might not smell the best, because, um, yeah, well, they're stepping in their trim poop, here. so. Once your dad comes back, he's getting trimmed. Yeah, a lot of them. I think Jack needs some, too. The rest of them don't look really bad. He just, Nick couldn't catch him. My horse is, like, evil to dad. <laughs> he doesn't like other people. He only likes me and Alicia. Well, he never used to like me. He only yeah. liked Alicia. <laughs> and then he just left his home. And the, the, the really, actually, kind of comical thing is, Chuck was supposed to be my dad's horse, and um, the wild horse spirit was supposed to be hers. Well, look what happened. <laughs> Chuck is her horse, and um, dad doesn't have a horse. <laughs> dad doesn't have a horse. But yeah, okay. But he's a good so horse. That okay. she'll pick up hooves. Bye. Okay. <laughs>